My name is Dan Cheatham, and I am with Legends Consulting. I'd like to discuss past tense with you, German past tense. There are two different types of past tense. You have the past tense, what the Germans called imperfect, and the past tense that we call the past participle past tense, uh, that the Germans refer to as imperfect. We'd like, I'd like for you to learn the imperfect, the past participle version of a um, spoken past tense sentence. You will be utilizing the auxiliary verb or the helping verb haben, to have, or sein, to be, depending on the verb you're going to be using. I know it sounds complicated, just run with me. All right, you'll have an infinitive, which is the verb itself, such as spielen, to play, spielen. In the past, it receives a GE at the beginning, ge, spiel, and then the ending becomes a T, gespielt. So spielen, the infinitive, becomes gespielt as a past participle. Ich habe gespielt. I, auxiliary verb habe, and the past participle gespielt, right? Ich habe gespielt. I played, all right? Ich habe gearbeitet. Arbeiten is the word verb work. Gearbeitet would be the weak verb past participle, gearbeitet. Ich habe gearbeitet. A strong version of a, what they call a strong verb would be trinken. That's where the stem part of the verb changes. Ich habe getrunken. G-E. And then trunken. The stem part has changed. Ich habe getrunken. Some motion verbs do not take haben, they take sein, which is um, the to be auxiliary helping verb. Ich bin gegangen. Gehen, to go. Ich bin gegangen. Or, ich bin gefahren. Fahren, to drive. Past tense, gefahren. Ich bin gefahren. 